All right, boys, happy Halloween. We are here with the new Halloween set. I'm going to run through all the new cards, um, all the master set players, the packs, all the good stuff, and we're going to open up some packs as well, so let's get into it. All right, so as you can see, we got the Halloween characters. You see all the master items there. We see all these. So we're, what we're going to do quickly here is we're just going to run through the cards in the collection here. Um, I'm going to run down everything, all the sins that each card has, which master set players are worth it, um, so here we go. So we're gonna start off with the 90 John Carlson. This 90 John Carlson is probably the best one to get. You got Howitzer and Distributor on this card. Distributor this year is the synergy to have for your team. So Howitzer and, and Distributor are both big and good synergies. So you definitely want to make this John Carlson if you're gonna make this set. Uh, we have a Zach Cassian again. I don't know. Uh, it's a card, I guess, dude. Uh, it, it's a decent card with both synergies on. With them off, it's still decent it's a 90 overall at the end of the day um but yeah zach cassian uh you got this marcel nobles which is very interesting to make this guy but howitzer and barrage is not bad um this car actually looks really good 99 agility 89 speed um slap shot his wrist shots really good good offensive awareness this card is is very close to uh carlson you know i think right now it's one and two uh between the two uh, you got a Colton Pareko, Balance and Workhorse. Workhorse is a good synergy. Balance is a decent synergy as well. Again, with these synergies on, it's amazing with them off, man. It's a pretty decent defenseman. I still think John Carlson is better than Colton. A Tevu Teravainen with Magician and Swarm. Uh, with these synergies on, again, the card looks amazing. Most of these cards look amazing with the synergies on. With it off, it's still a very good looking card. Um, he's definitely a top line winger right now uh, for your team if you were to get him But Tevu looks very good as well. Uh, you got Linus Allmark a goalie I don't know how many people are gonna make this card a 90 overall goalie man goalies in this game are really like I don't know they're One day they're good one day. They're bad. So if you want to make this go ahead, I don't recommend so those are the 90s You obviously can make their 89s here um, Again, these cards look amazing. The designs look amazing props to the EA NHL team for the designs we went over the 90s, the 89s are just one overall less, so I'm not going to go through them. Um, you do have a chance to make 88 overall players. Again, I'll run through the sets to show you guys. Um, but Theo Fleury is one of the 88s, passing playmaker as a synergy, a decent looking card. Pretty fast winger, uh, decent shot, uh, good stick checking, good passing. And then the other 88 is a Tepo Numenum. He was very good for me last year. Workhorse synergy. This card actually looks very good with the synergy on. 86 Excel, 93 Balance, 91 Endurance with the synergy on. So not a bad 88 overall. So getting into the 86s and all that good stuff, we got a John Gibson has a heart and soul synergy. Again, goalies are wonky. So if you want to buy him, buy him. If you pull him, use him. Uh, we got a Patrick Kane with Magician. This card looks absolutely insane. I believe this is a plus two from his base card. So this is definitely worth it. With the Magician Synergy 2, looks amazing. We got a Mitch Marner, Magician as well. This is the card I'm looking to pull when we do open up that pack. Uh, I do have his 84 and that card is unreal. I can only imagine how good this 86 overall is going to be. With Magician, 94 agility. Um, he's fast, obviously. Good shot. He'd be great to have. Steven Stamkos is a very good one. He has Howitzer, a very good synergy you want to probably have activated on your team. 93 agility, 92 speed, 94 slap shot power, 92 rush shot power with the Howitzer synergy. This guy is top of the 86s. 85 overall, Sean Burke. Um, yeah, I'm not even going to go over it. Those are the stats. If you want to pause the video and look at it, go for it. Connor Hellbuck, another goaltender. This 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 card might actually be good. Um, I know his base card was very good. A lot of people use him, so Connor Hellbuck got an 85. Uh, we got a Ron Hextel at an 85. He was OP last year. Might be a shell to use him this year. Card looks decent. Has a swarm synergy. Uh, we have a Curtis Joseph. We actually absolutely love that. Uh, 5'11 goaltender, though. I don't know. That'll be interesting. He has a barrage. Um, we got a Bill Ranford with the spark synergy. We have uh, Anders Lee with Gladiator. Decent looking card if you do have Gladiator activated. If you don't, still looks decent. Wouldn't be a bad pull. Uh, Zach Wierenski with Speedster. This is a good card with Speedster activated. 87 speed, 89 endurance, uh, 83 excel kind of sucks. He's got a decent wrist shot, okay slap shot. Uh, not a bad card. Kevin Hayes at an 83 with Gladiator. Decent looking 83 overall. We got an 82 Jeff Carter with Howitzer. Not a bad fourth line center, or if you want to play him on the wing as well, he's decently fast. Has a pretty good shot. Not a bad 82 overall. Uh, yeah, of course, I'm going to have yours a Den Chara. He's very spooky, obviously. With Workhorse, this card, uh, dude, he's slow 
slow, just very slow is a word to use for this Adenochara. Adam Fox with Speedster, not a bad card, actually a very fast defenseman. He wouldn't be bad to use as like a third line defenseman on your team, not a bad 82 overall. Ryan Hosa at an 81, you can get this card from doing hot challenges. Uh, Light the Lamp looks like a decent card, and a Jamie Oleksiak with Workhorse, uh, another decent 81 overall. You can also get a Henrik Zetterberg apparently, Light the Lamp, decent looking 81 overall, and that is all. Okay, and now looking at the sets for all these cards, obviously you can trade in 50 gold players for a gold collectible. You can trade in two gold collectibles for a choice of one of two Halloween player items, Um, you know, those 86 to 81 over, or 82 overalls. Um, so I wouldn't recommend doing that Two gold collectibles is way too much again It's the same thing eight gold collectibles to get an untradeable 89 overall master item and then 10 to get a tradable one Now these are new to this set here each player has a different way to get in their 90 That is obviously untradeable though for this guy for Marcel Nobles I don't know if I'm saying his last name right you have to trade in his team jersey along with nine gold collectibles for Zach Cassian, you got to trade in his base item and the Edmonton home jersey along with nine gold collectibles. And it's the same for these base Tevu and a Kane's jersey with eight, nine gold collectibles. Same with Carlson, same with Pareko, same with Olmark. Here you can trade in, um, I think it's some gold players. So uh, Freddy, uh, Nicholas Baxter, Latang, Kachuk, Chara, this guy, and six gold collectibles for a choice of one or two 88 overall players, which is the ones I showed you from before. Here you can trade in a uh, goalie mask, a jersey, and one gold collectible for an 85 overall Ron Hext. I'll show you what that looks like in here. Here, same thing for Cujo, same thing for Bill Ranford, and same thing for Sean Burke. And then here, uh, trade in Halloween collectibles for an untradeable mask man pack. Uh, so I guess that's one of the packs in the store. I think I already have three of these, so uh, maybe that's something I could do for the video. But that's all the sets there, and then I will show you guys the pack. It's the generic packs that um, you know usually come out with every set. You have the 65k pack, the untradeable Halloween characters starter pack, 12 items including a gold collectible and a guaranteed Halloween player item, which is that 82 to 86 overall player. You have your Halloween Goblin pack, 30 items, 20 players with at least 180 plus overall. And then you got your Masked Man pla uh, pack, 20 items, at least 9 players with at least 182 plus overall player two guaranteed jerseys and two guaranteed goalie helmets so not a bad set i'm kind of pretty bummed out that the sets are pretty much similar from last event like ea's gotta find a way to change it up somehow i don't know how but like these trading in gold collectibles for an untradeable or a tradable master item it's starting to get old, man. I'll be real honest with you. All right, with that being said, it is time to open up these packs. We are hoping for that 86 Mitch Marner. That's what we want. Here we go. Give me that 86 Marner. We get a guaranteed gold collectible, which is huge. Marner, though, is what we want. Stamkos! Okay, we'll take that. It's an 86. It's an 86. We wanted an 86. This is one of the best 86s, too. Howitzer, uh, I'm very close to having it done, too. Um, yeah, we'll take a Stamkos all day, every day. It's not a Mitch Marner, but it is a Steven Stamkos. So, bang, we will definitely take that. Um, I doubt there's going to be anything left in this pack here. Uh, we do have some other packs to open up, uh, up after this as well, which is nice. Uh, where's our gold collectible? Nick Shore, Leaf Legend. And there's our gold collectible. But, hey, you know what, man? We pulled a purple. Steven Stamkos, welcome to the team. Okay, so, you know what? We're going to try opening up the Masked Man pack. We get 182 plus overall, so interesting stuff here who's gonna be our 82 plus and hopefully it's higher than 82 plus but let's see what we get here okay it's kind of a big pack curtis lazar on the sabers now did not know that goalie mask luke coon come on who's gonna be our 82 plus abraham off i don't know i don't know i'm so bad with names man winter hawks just okay it's good. We will take it. It's a purple. That's our 82 plus. We pulled two purples in this pack opening. Um, he does have an 87 team of the week out, but we will take his 86. Distributor synergy. He's one of the best goalies in the game right now. Vasilevsky, what a pack opening. We will definitely take that. We got our guaranteed 82 plus overall, and it was none other than Vasilevsky. We got a couple of cards left here in this pack. Doubt there's anything left. 750 coins, which is nice. But we will definitely take a Vasilevsky. Anyways, guys, that is it for this video. Um, let me know what you guys think of the new Halloween set. Like I said, 
the set wise i'm not too happy with what ea is doing it's just copy and paste like every other event but hopefully it gets changed uh let me know if you guys are going to be doing the master set which master set you're gonna take also let me know if you opened up that guaranteed player pack and if who you got from it i got stamkos i got lucky let me know what you guys got and uh yeah that's it for this video thank you guys very much for watching and i'll talk to you guys later peace